Hello and welcome to Game Over. The real World Cup starts, one can say, with the Super 12s, Australia versus South Africa, and of course, uh, West Indies versus England. Two massive games, massive games. Australia versus South Africa, my eyes will be on David Warner, has been rusty, people have been talking a lot about him. But David Warner, come at the hour, come at the big man, there is a lot of pressure on him and he will know that this is perhaps his chance to prove everyone wrong. Incredible amount of, uh, 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 how do I put it, that's tremendous potential. But more importantly, the man has great resilience. So watch out for David Warner. Uh, unfancied but very impressive, Ashton Agar. There's Marcus Stoinis, some of these players for Australian, of course, big show Glenn Maxwell, who's been in tremendous form. For uh, South Africa, obviously, Quinton Decock, Temba Bovuma, Rassi van der Dassen are important players. The second game, England versus the West Indies, no Jofra, no Ben Stokes, England weakened, but despite that, uh, Jason Roy, uh, Johnny Basto, that's a good side. And West Indies, come on. I mean, some of the best T20 players in that lineup led by Kyron Pollard. If they start to come good, they will light up this tournament. But the question is, can they do justice to their T20 potential? As I said, two fantastic clashes lined up in the Super 8 stage. And I will bring you everything here on Game Over. So keep watching.